Hi guys, Wacker here. Um, finally, we have something good to talk about. Let's bring the mod tools up. And let's do new. And look, we have, now can do zombie mod levels. So let's create a zombie test. Let's fire up Radiant. And we can have a look at the uh, sample. So, open zombies, uh, zombie test. And this is, if you create a blank template, this is what it's given us. Uh, let's just render the light. So what we got? So we've got a basic window. A lot of funky lights. Some missing assets by the looks of it. But they uh, won't complain about that at the moment. There's a packer punch. Um, let's come out of this. And let's see if we can actually get it to work. So I'll quickly export the lights. Okay. Let's find a zombie test. Let's compile a link. We're not worried about detail the light. Away it goes. Hopefully it won't take long to compile because uh, there's not too much lighting in this. That's the lighting nearly done, and then we just need it to link. So it's linking there, processing. It's now going to convert some textures. And hopefully this will work, and then you can see the base of it. Um, it's 8 o'clock in the morning here, so uh, these assets dropped six hours ago, so I've missed six hours actually having a look at these. And then I've got to go out, but I am going to uh, put the, as long as this works, I'll put these into a real map and show it working in practice. And I'm also going to do some videos covering all the new assets that we've been given. Uh, let's hope this doesn't take too long. Tick tock. You can actually, I don't think I've shown you the compile and sequence go before. My link is still running. Gives you a good idea of timing, I guess. This is on a you know blank map, so. Uh, the one thing that wouldn't happen once if you've already done it, you won't get the converting of textures. So each converting image here is a new texture that's not yet been converted. But once it's been converted, it doesn't need to do this process again. Uh, but all the other items that are flashing by do need to run. Oh, we must nearly be there, surely. You'll probably want to fast forward this bit. <laughs> wow, there's a lot more uh, texture assets on this. My um, CPU is getting a good old hammering. Um, obviously, the better and more cores you got, the faster this process is going to work. Uh, it's on an SSD, so even when you see the disk jump into 90, that's on an SSD. So it gives you an idea of uh, you need a decent performance PC if you want to do things quickly, but it doesn't mean that you um, are not going to be able to do it if you've not got an SSD or you haven't got a decent processor. It'll still work. If you've got, just got a basic um, i3, um, 
it's going to work, it's just going to take a lot longer than you see it taking now. Uh, this is taking longer than I thought, so there's obviously a lot more textures involved than I thought. Well, while waiting, uh, so Treyarch have been having uh, issues getting this uh, latest drop out to us. Uh, it's not their fault. They've just found uh, uh, a number of issues along the way. This is why it's taken so long between uh, my last updates uh, really to show you anything. And this is the bit that a lot of people have been asking for, because as we all know, as the uh, Call of Duty mapping community died off, uh, the only thing that was left really was the zombie mapping and modding. Uh, I do hope though that this revitalizes both areas because it used to be that the multiplayer um, was the stronger side. Um, I must admit I play more zombie games than I do multiplayer these days. Uh, this looks like it's done so let's see if we can run it and let's go. Uh, but Trek have done a really good job. Uh, they've released something um, which everybody's been asking for. Um, we've still got no ETA on anything along the lines of uh, when the beta's coming out, but given the issues that we keep finding and the fact they are making these tools, um, although the Radiant Editor is you know, probably good to go, everything else that goes around it uh, is being made from scratch in many respects because the tools they have are um, not uh, not something they can give out because they're all licensed software so they've had to rewrite and rework lots of code to make this work and there's a lot of their own time and effort going into this lobby error okay can we not test it that could be the big downfall no no we can I see so those objects that weren't in there were these the packer punches Zombie! Hallelujah! And the zombies die. Oh, this is going to be really easy to um, put into any map now that we have these. Um, except one of those zombies is going the wrong way. Uh, let's start with that. Now, we have one gun on the wall. I'm wondering what that was for. Because uh, one thing I can't see is the door things, but I can't imagine making doors is any different to normal. You'll just put the cost on like you used to. Ah, it's going to help me. Where do I turn the power on? Uh, that's a really good question. Anybody see a switch? Um, okay. Uh, I'm going to have to find where the power switch is. Uh, but not to fear. I'm not overly worried because even if it's not in this demo uh, or in the base template here, we are going to be able to find it. So if I cancel this, I'm going to fire Radiant up. Uh, this might take a while, um, so the next thing I do, so what I will probably do is just show something else that we do have, uh, which you may already know if you follow Twitter or you've listened to any other videos of me rambling on. We have the giant map source. Uh, I'll quickly see how quickly this is going to load in. If it's going to take a while, I'll make another video, I think. Uh, the reason I'm thinking it might take a while, if there's any assets it's not converted, it's going to take a month and a Sunday. Uh, we will give it a minute. Um, so if I'm going to use a map, there should be some uh, zombie giant zone source. So we've got the zone file. We can have a look what's going on here. We can see the scripts it's using. Uh, one thing I've noticed, uh, we don't have the scripts for the zombie giants, which is not the end of the world. 
but I'm going to have to ask for those. So here's all the bits, pack a punch. Yeah, I mean they're all in here, so it's not going to be too bad. We can see what's going on here. This doesn't concern me at the moment. Uh, this is obviously converting images. Uh, if it's the last one, we're fine. Uh, it's probably Muller in my PC. Yeah, not really. No, uh, gosh. Right, I'm going to create another video uh, later on. We'll